The Cornish Pirates Rugby Club are running with a different kind of ball. In a joint initiative with Cornwall County Council, the club's youth learning zone has put together an art programme for 26 gifted and talented youngsters aged between 9 and 11 from eight Penwith schools. Centre tutor John Watson is working alongside professional artist Clive Williams to demonstrate techniques and skills during the 10-week programme. Cornwall Online Radio's Mike Dees went along to a recent session held at the Penzance Arts Club where he spoke with John, Clive and students. John, what's going on here today? Well, you're seeing week six out of a 10-week programme for 24 children from the East Penzance cluster of schools including St Hilary, Ludgevan and Marazion schools. The children are working with artist Clive Williams, going to the St Ives School of Painting to work with the life model clothed and working at the Penzance Arts Club and attending various visits to art galleries like the Tate and Penley House. You mentioned Clive, he's just joined us. Clive, hello. hello. Very experienced artist, uh, I've known of you and I know your work for a long time. Tell me about these young people. Most of them have good ability, most of them are working in mediums that they probably haven't experienced before. This session we're working on looking at rooftops from Penzance Arts Club with a view of the Nicholson show which is on at the Tate Gallery in St Ives. We're not copying the Nicholson's but we're looking at the Nicholson's as a stimulus mm -hmm. and using rooftops. The previous group used still life, this time we're using rooftops. At the end of the course, Clive, what do you expect the young people to have uh, gained from um, an experience of drawing from observation but putting in a very personal input into their finished works. I'm not directing the work, I'm just giving them the stimulus and the ideas of drawing using drawing tools as I call them, I don't call them pens or pencils, drawing tools, sharpened sticks, using the ink which will blot to make different images to make marks which become very personal these uh, marks I, I saw you doing this blotting with uh, you just took a piece of a, a, a yellow, magazine page and you yellow were, pages you, you, you were teaching them to to blot their work mm. they're currently drawing on fairly soft absorbent paper I use yellow pages paper because it's got a certain quality that the newspapers have got for some reason and it just absorbs the, sur the surplus ink. There's no quality in newspapers anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Not the printed matter, but the actual paper itself. <laughs> John, now you're still teaching. How do you fit this in with your teaching days? This, this is a, oh, well, uh, I work for an organisation, the Cornish Pirates Learning Zone, which is affiliated to what's called Playing for Success, and it's part of a national um, network of 164 centres which are affiliated to sporting clubs around the country for instance all the Premier League in football all of the first class counties all of the Premiership rugby and many others for example Wimbledon, Wembley, Cheltenham Racecourse, Silverstone they all have a centre and every month or every term 60 children in those 164 centres go through so the, these kids here are part of a much much larger network and I think this is a bit of a groundbreaking project here which starts on the premise that as a working artist in Cornwall you have to be everything to yourself you've got to be an artist producing the work you've got to sometimes make your frames you've got to be your own accounts manager and be your own press officer sometimes Eleanor Mountford how old are you? 10 10 and what school are you at? St Hilary OK, how did you find out about this course? My teacher told us, she called us in, and then we, right. she told us about it. OK, and what are you getting out of doing this? Well, I'm learning new skills and I've never done what we're doing now. Yeah, before. just explain to me what, what you're doing today, Eleanor. Earlier we put pastel on some paper, smudged it and then sprayed it with hairspray. And then we went outside and drew the angles of the buildings and mm. boats. And that's in the style of Ben Nicholson. Uh, that's right, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Okay. So, what are you going to be doing next time? Do you know when you come back next time? Um, I think we're going to St Ives School of Painting to hang out. Exhibition. Are you? Yeah. Oh, I was there two weeks ago. It's good there. Yeah. yeah. Helena, thank you very much. Good okay. luck. Okay. Thank you. Good. Connor, what are you hoping to get out of this art course that you're on? Well, you know, I just want to get some more art skills, really. Hmm. 
like learn more stuff about it. What what sort of medium do you like working with? I like using like chalks and like pastels. Pastels. Yeah, right. oil pastels mm. and stuff. Yeah. yeah like for the smudging, things, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah. I like smudging, yeah. yeah. And well, the colours. We've been doing some smudging with Clive today. Yeah. He's yeah. been teaching you how to use those yellow page sheets mm. and uh, and block the work yeah, so you get some yeah. nice textures in it. Yeah. Yeah, I haven't seen that done before. Mm. And you're, you're outside on the balcony here at the Arts Club today. Yeah. It's a nice sunny day. Yeah. And uh, we're coming out of winter at last, I think. And yeah. uh, you're out there with your friends and you're measuring with a stick and you're you're doing the perspectives of the roof skate, which yeah. is a Ben Nicholson yeah. uh, style of uh, painting, yeah. wasn't it? So like we're doing the rooftops and stuff. Yes, yeah. 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 So there's a lot to see because you're looking out there across the harbour towards uh, St Michael's Mount and Marazion and beyond. Mm. So there's an awful lot of roofscapes here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. You've got to have your eye on lots yeah. of things. Yeah. And different shades with the way yeah. the sun is falling. Yeah, there's today. loads of um, boats and everything. Yes, so. and the boats. Yeah. yeah, yeah, good. Connor, thank you very much indeed. Okay. Good luck with everything. Thank you. Okay. To find out more about Pirates Learning Zone activities, email Centre Manager Kevin Jackson at learningzone at cornishpirates.com. This has been a Cornwall Online Radio community interest feature produced and directed by Julian Rowe.